Hey everyone, it is Skin Diaries episode number five, I think. I forgot because I skipped a week. Um, mainly because I didn't want to show my face <gasps> um, on camera because I was trying to speed up this process of clearing my face and I tried apple cider um, and put it on my face but I did the dumb thing and didn't dilute it with water I just did it straight from the bottle and my face broke out really bad and yeah so I only did that for like two days and I stopped and my face is clearing up and whatnot um, as far as breakouts I'm still breaking out uh, what else is new um, but I don't know if I mentioned this last time but I am using this uh, every day every night now and um, I think it's working better once I use it every day so yeah and also I wanted to try a new moisturizer so um, I got the Pons the Pons Clarent B3 moisturizer for normal to oily skin and I heard a lot of things a lot of good things about this I did my research like I do all the time before I buy something and um, it's supposed to it claims on here it even skin tone in two weeks and reduces the appearance of dark spots in four weeks now I don't know if they can do that for my face because um, my dark spots like my acne scars are so deep set because I've had them for years now um, I think it's too late and the damage is done so I don't know if it can do that but for the breakouts that I get now like the new ones it can help them from scarring like if they do scar it'll probably get rid of the scars faster so give this a try um, it's made in Mexico <laughs> um, and it's the pink um, container I you get a lot in here I have no clue but you 200 grams which is a lot and I've, I've been using it for like a week now and it's very um it's not a cream it's not thick at all it's very moussey kind of, not very moussey it's kind of moussey it's like an airy feel to it kind of and uh, about this don't use that much if you do use this do not use a lot um and when it takes the only downside is it takes a little bit longer to absorb into your skin and but when it does you know how the feeling like if you rub glue on your skin and then it starts drying and it gets like tacky and rough that's how this feels once this starts absorbing to your skin so once you don't see it on your face anymore just don't rub it anymore because then it's going to feel tacky like glue and it doesn't feel good that's the only downside to this but um yeah it does moisturize really nicely and it mattifies your skin on contact which is why i said it could be used as a um primer a makeup primer in the direction so that's what i use it for i use it in what I'm um, rendering right now, which is my Gangudo um, Halloween makeup, that will be in a contest too, and um, you'll see that in this in the video. So yeah, uh, that's all I have to say. Um, I didn't do a video last week because, uh, like I said, my face and yeah, and um, I'm doing this earlier this week because my dad's supposed to come over tomorrow, so I won't have time to make a video. So yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, see you guys next week. Bye.